Welcome back to the channel. I'm Espen Croft. Thanks for watching. This is the Boss Chorus Pedal CE-2 or CE2. And this is a vintage one. I find this a great analog chorus to use on synthesizers and especially synthesizers with a mono output like this uh, Korg Poly 61. This particular pedal is from October 1981. I know this because it has the serial number inside and you can cross-reference that with um, a website that tells you the year of manufacture of uh, both Roland products and Boss products. I'll link to that in the video description. And uh, it has only two settings. It has the chorus rate and the chorus depth, but that's really all you need to get some really lush sounds going from your synthesizer. And uh, I know there exists a lot of other chorus pedals uh, from Boss uh, and new editions, but I really like the vintage ones. They have this sort of, um, yeah, vintage vibe that I'm going for, especially when I'm working on my album as I am right now. And uh, so today I'm going to show you some of the sounds you can get out of this and the Korg Poly 61 while I'm working on some uh, sounds and melody lines, hooks, for my album. Bear in mind, it's not necessarily what you're hearing today that will end up on the album. I'm fleshing out ideas, as I always do, on my songs while working on them.
I also have this um, Boss catalog from, uh, this is from 1985, and um, there's a description of the CE2 inside here, and I also have this um, price list again from the mid 80s, and I can see that um, in Scandinavia, the price for the CE2 was in Crowner about 800, it says 810, and that would be around $75 in 1985 money. So the Boss Chorus Pedal CE2 from 1981, it gives you that nice thick vintage analog chorus, just two controls, easy PC, especially useful on synths with mono outputs as I showed you here, since this is a mono pedal. As always, I'm Espencroft and I am the 80s, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time, bye for now.